student was robbed near campus over the weekend and police were able to arrest the alleged thief. But as our Danielle Ledbetter reports tonight, the incident has more people in that area nervous. That's what's sad to me. Martin Donovan says he's in this area near 32nd Avenue and Orleans Drive a lot. So this is the neighborhood where my car was broken into. He says he learned the hard way when his $500 guitar was stolen that everything isn't as it seems. I sold everything that I had to buy this guitar. He says that's why he's not shocked to learn a Vanderbilt University student was robbed nearby at gunpoint on Saturday morning. It looks safe. It looks homey in Nashville. It looks like a nice neighborhood, but there is theft here. Around 6.35 a.m., the Vanderbilt student told police someone approached her from behind, put a gun to her back, and said, drop everything you have and give me your purse. The student told police she gave the man $70 and ran away. While the incident did not happen on Vanderbilt's campus, they said in a statement, we are deeply committed to ensuring the safety of our community members. We strongly encourage Vanderbilt community members to download the Vandy Safe app. People don't know that there's a bunch of like people that are going to rob you. Police say the same man, Marquise Douglas, tried to rob an 89 year old woman later that morning. They noticed him walking in a nearby park and through surveillance video, they were able to connect him to the first incident near Vanderbilt. Donovan says as Nashville changes, don't be fooled just because an area looks nice. You need to watch your back. Don't be alone at night. Carry mace, pepper spray. I don't want to say this is the jungle, but obviously if something just happened here, then this is the jungle. Danielle Ledbetter, WSMB4.